Hi everyone, and welcome to part 37 of Let's Play The Sims 4 Season 2. So Ryan and Kaden are just getting out of bed here in the honeymoon suite of the Windenburg Inn, and to start off their honeymoon, I wanted to have the two of them go downstairs and get some breakfast because I did turn this lot back into a restaurant and gave it the brunch menu. So I thought that would be a perfect way to start off their day. But first, wait, what is what is Ryan doing? Oh, going into another room to go to the bathroom. Okay, whatever. I mean, they're not occupied, so it's fine. Okay, Bills, that's cool. But uh, first, before going downstairs, I wanted to change them into the outfits I specially made for their honeymoon because after their breakfast, I'm going to have them go around and explore Windenburg a little bit as tourists. So I thought it'd be fitting to give them tourist outfits because last time I did mention that I was thinking about giving them the tourist outfits that came with City Living. But Techie74 suggested that I give Kaden the tourist outfit and then give Ryan, you know, like leave Ryan in his usual clothes, which I thought that was, I thought was a cute idea because um, they said that, you know, Ryan could kind of laugh a little bit at how dorky Kaden is, but at the same time he loves him for it. And Skychime658 brought up that, you know, maybe instead of using that outfit, I could just use one of the other button-up shirts in the game and some cargo shorts. So anyway, what I did was I combined those ideas. So for Kaden, we've got... Come on, come on, why aren't they coming up? There we go. All right, so for Kaden, we've got the typical tourist outfit, which I think... No, you're supposed to change before you go downstairs. Whatever. All right, fine. Just go downstairs, go downstairs in your PJs and then... Okay, let's get you out of your PJs, too. Um, so anyway, we got that for Caden, and then for Ryan, we've just got this button up shirt and some cargo pants. So, I mean, it's still kind of touristy, but it looks a little bit cooler. Uh, Caden is, is just about full on tourist, though. I couldn't bring myself to do the whole socks and sandals thing. That That's kind of where I stopped with it, but, I mean, it does look pretty touristy. I think the look actually suits him in a way. And I've just been wanting a reason to use this outfit, so here we are. Um, but, well, not really, but, um, anyway, we're gonna get on with the brunch. Okay, no, actually, instead of doing it that way, let's just pick out a table. So, do we want to have them eat outside? Ooh, looks like we still got some of their family and friends around. I guess they, you can think of it as they just kind of stayed here after the wedding. Um, you know what, I think we'll just have them eat inside, so we'll request this table over here. There we go. That seems nice. Ooh, I also got Ryan. Why is it not going over to him? What is he doing? Okay, there we go. Now it's working. But I did get Ryan a camera so that we can go ahead and take a bunch of photos. Alright, come on. We're gonna go eat breakfast. Um, yeah, so hopefully this will take a few hours and then after that we'll get them on out to explore Windenburg. Not sure where we're gonna go first. Alright, are we on requesting the table? I don't know why it's being so slow when switching between the Sims. Okay, good. He's on requesting that. Alrighty, so let's get them over there, then they can order their delicious breakfast. I'm actually really excited for this honeymoon, because uh, it's a bit different than the usual going to Granite Falls honeymoon that I've done before. I really hope they add in some more vacation destinations, though, because that'd be nice. It'd be nice to have somewhere maybe tropical to go, although I know there is the, I think there was like the tropical mod that makes Granite Falls look like a tropical world, but I think it'd be really cool if there was just like a separate tropical world. Alright, no, come on, sit Okay. All right, all right. So we did this wrong. Okay, let's give up the tail. I forgot we had to have them in a group. Okay, the two of them are at their table now. And, oh, it looks like Bobby's come over to chat with them. I'm not sure if he's really... I don't think he's really going to actually join them, but... Yeah, it's cool to see some of them sticking around here. Um, but you know what? Actually, let's focus on them. So we'll just go ahead and order some breakfast for the table. Okay, so what do we want to go with? We want to just go with some coffee? Yeah, let's go with some coffee or tea or something like that for drink. Early. I feel like, I'm guessing that's, um, isn't that a Star Trek reference? Like, I think it was, um, from the next generation or something like that. I don't know. I haven't watched all the Star Trek episodes, but I've heard that reference before. Um, so anyway, let's, I don't know. We'll get the chef's choice for him and then we'll get the Americano for him. All right, that sounds good. And then... Going down here, what are we gonna get? All right, breakfast scramble. Ooh, maybe that would be good. Some pancakes, I got some omelets, eggs benedict, French toast. Ooh, eggs and toast, that's pretty plain. Oh, we'll get the chef's choice. I mean, that mean, that's gotta mean it's good. So we can get that for him and then um, we'll get, I don't know, we'll just get French toast. All right, there we go, so that's good. And then maybe we'll get some dessert after that. All right, so we got our food, we're good to go. Let's have them, ooh, whoops. Let's have them talk a little bit. 
So, I don't know, we could have them... We'll have them express fondness. Ooh, and they also have that Just Married moodlet, so that'll last for a couple more days. So that's really sweet. Um, and I did have both of them take off work today, so we don't have to worry about the going off to work. Unfortunately, he didn't have any vacation days, so I had to have him call in fake sick, but I mean, he just got married, so he's got to take the day off. Oh, it looks like he wants to woohoo with someone. Uh, maybe later today we can do that. Uh, so what does he want to do? He wants to tell Dirty... Okay, ooh, let's do that. So, let me see. There we go. We'll take care of that. What do we have? Yellow George. Oh, George. Flynn Henry. Oh, the Flynn Henrys. Try for a bit. Um. <laughs> uh, I don't think. I, I, I mean, I, I don't think that's possible that he can try for food. Oh, I feel like that's definitely some kind of glitch. I just find it funny that saying try for. I mean, I guess I guess it just means that he wants to have a kid with him. Um. Oh, so speaking of that. I was thinking that for these two, rather than going with adoption, maybe we could do something a little different and I guess have a surrogate. Like I was thinking I could have a female sim and use her as a surrogate for the two of them so then their kid would have would be biologically the child of one of them. And there was mention of an IVF mod in the comments of the last part. So it'd be great if that existed because otherwise I'd wait wait what I didn't catch up with that was, because I mean, otherwise, I would have to actually have one of them woohoo at the sim, and I don't really want to do that. Um, but then again, I don't know, I'm just worried if there's a mod about that, it'll be kind of glitchy, I don't know. I mean, I could just have the, one of them woohoo at that sim, and then just get rid of the romantic relationship, or something like that. But, um, yeah, I thought it would be good to maybe do something a little different than adoption for these two. Um, or maybe, maybe I could do adoption with the first kid, and then that with the second one, but I don't know. I kind of want to do that with the first one, so I was thinking that... I could do that for the next time we're with this household. So let me know what you all think of that, because I was thinking maybe I could have you all make potential surrogates for them, then I could pick one, although I feel kind of bad because I could only pick one. But yeah, let me know what you all think of that, and I'll further discuss it in the next part. Um, that was a really good segue into that, actually, because I wanted to bring that up and I was worried I was going to forget, but yeah, thank you, game, for giving me a really good segue into that topic. Um, so anyway, let's compliment his appearance. Tell me he looks dashing today. Um, should we have him? I, maybe we can have him compliment his appearance. I mean, I feel like he's probably just kind of laughing at how dorky he looks. Like, it's just, it's just adorkable, I guess. Like, it's, like, so, so dorky, it's adorable. I love it. I, I just feel like it's so Caden. Um, let's blow a kiss at him. All right, so they're done with their... Wait, did they get... I think they got their coffee. I wasn't really paying attention. I was when I was rambling. Hmm, should we get them dessert? Yeah, they're still teensy bit hungry. You know, this is their honeymoon. Let's just, let's just go for it and get dessert. <laughs> I love how synchronized I was. All right. Let's go ahead and order that dessert. Maybe another round of drinks. Nah, I think we're fine. We'll just get the dessert. So what do we have? We have apple pie. Um, sounds good. We'll get that. Maybe that and. A lemon bar. Alright. It's good to me. Oh, wait. I, it's, oh, it's the afternoon already. Okay, so we gotta get on with this. Maybe I shouldn't... Uh, okay, you know what? I'm... Yeah, I'm just gonna skip it, because I really... I really just want to get them out on the town, so I'd rather do that than have them stick around here till like, 3 o'clock in the evening for... Or, damn it, is he ordering? Oh, whoops. Okay, I didn't actually do that. Uh, let's just let's just end the meal and pay the bill. I think we can just stop it. Yeah, we can just stop before we get that. All right, there we go. We're good to go. So let's get on with the exploration of Windenburg. Um, so where where should we go first? Hmm. So the main places I wanted to explore are, of course, Von Hahn Estate and the ancient ruins and the bluffs. And then I was thinking that maybe this evening we could end it by having them go to a nightclub. Although, I mean, I'd probably change how the outfits that they're wearing. Um, but where should we have them go first? I'm thinking the bluffs might be a good place to start off with. So they can just have a private afternoon swim out there. And I don't think I'm going to be able to go to all three of those places in this part. So I know last time I said, oh, I think I only need to spend two parts of this household this time. But I think I might actually do three because I'm having fun with this. I mean... We're just getting started with it, but I'm having fun with this little honeymoon part, so... Yeah, I think it might be fun to do another one 
So I don't know. Let me, let me know what you'll think of that. Although, I don't know. I might just do it anyway because I'm... I'm having fun with this. I really want to get to explore all... I mean, I know we've already kind of seen all of Windenburg with Get Together having been out for over a year, but I don't know. I'm just having fun with these two exploring and as tourists. So why... Can't... Oh, my God. I was clicking on him. What am I doing? All right. So let's flirt with him. Ooh, and then we should also take some pictures. So let's do that as well. Let's just take a picture of Caden. So we can get one right here in front of the secret entrance and then perhaps we could have them go over in front of the water and get another one and then maybe just take a picture of the two of them together. And then when they get back from this vacation, I want to just hang up the pictures throughout their apartment. So I just want to take a bunch. All right, are we going to take a fit? Okay, there we go. Oh, look at that. It looks so confident. I think that's good. There we go. That's better. All right, so we'll set that to large and turn the flash off. There we go. All right, and then we can move the camera over into Caden's inventory and get a picture of Ryan in front of the water. So we'll just get them both over here, have him face in towards the land. Perfect. And then we just take a photo of them. And then after that, we'll just take a photo of the two of them. Um, maybe I'll take some more while they're here, but oh, look at that. You got the sailboats in the background. Perfect. Okay, uh, let's do that. All right, it looks good to me. It looks very confident. All right, and then now that we've done that, let's just get the photo of the two of them together. And then I think we'll be good for now. Yeah, because I just want to take a few pictures of them at each place. And then Sky Chimes brought up that with the different outfits they have, that you can really tell that, you know, the pictures are from their honeymoon, so it makes it kind of special. Yeah, I think that's nice. All right, so we'll just get a bunch of pictures. And then what should we have them do now? So I guess we can have them. Ooh, they can light a bonfire. Is it too... No, I don't think it's too early for the bonfire. Or I don't know. We can just have them go over here and swim for at first. So we can just swim here together. Maybe try out... Yeah, they can dive off of this for a little bit. So I'll just have them stay out here for, for a few hours. Um, Then maybe go somewhere else. And then after that, go out to the nightclub. Or I don't know. It'll probably take so long here that I'll just end up going to the nightclub after that. All right. Are we coming over here? It's actually been a while since I've been to the Bluffs. Like, I think the last time I went to the Bluffs was when my get-together Let's Play was... No, no, it wasn't. It was... Oh, it was earlier in the in this Let's Play. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, because I had Kala and Spencer and their little high school friends group go out, go out here. See, so, yeah, I have. Oh, I forgot to give him sunglasses with that. What are we doing? Okay, I don't know. You know, let's have you jump for the group. You could do a backflip. I'm not sure if he's going to be good at that or not. Um, yeah, maybe I should have skinny dip. I mean, they're the only two out here. So perhaps we'll do that. All right, let's see how well Ryan does with this. Caden, don't go there. He's going to land on you. Oh. Let's see, pitch black. Oh, oh, that was tea. I thought that was coffee. That was tea. Awesome. So I guess that went well. You know, let's have Caden have a go at it. So we'll have him do a swan dive. Let's see how that goes. And you know, let's have them skinny dip together. Let's just go for it. No one's here to see them. No one will care. <laughs> Ooh, nice. I'm hoping that some of these pictures they took actually turned out good. I think some of them did. Right? Yeah, that one looks like it's good. Caden has food poisoning. Oh, no. Oh, that seemed like such a nice place. Okay, so we could get on the phone and complain. Should we do that? Uh, how do we do that? Report food poisoning. Sure, why not? Let's go do that. Hopefully that doesn't ruin things too much with this. Uh, let me see. Yeah. That sucks. What a great way to start off the honeymoon. Oh, and then Ryan... You know, while Ryan's just patiently waiting over here, let's, uh... 
Let's try a cannonball. Ooh, we're taking Caden's claim of food poisoning very seriously. Please accept 112 simoleons as compensation for our mistake. Try drinking lots of water. Again, we're so sorry. Please don't tell me. <laughs> oh, really? Thanks for buying us off. I mean, if you're going to do that, he could have given us a little more than $100. That's really not much. <laughs> I mean, we're in a pool, so I guess that's fine. You can just... Mm, I don't think I'd want to drink this water, though. Yeah, it looks... Ah, oh, no, I missed the... Ah, whatever. Yeah, I don't think I'd want to drink this water, though. But... I don't know. We're near water. All right, let's get Caden back in the pool. Oh, he's <laughs> oh, he's filthy too. Wait, what is this? Why can't we get in the pool? Oh, Caden's... Oh, no. Did he crap his... Oh, what the... What the hell happened? <laughs> oh, poor Caden. Did he crap him? <laughs> you know what? I feel like this was karma for him taking off si like, sick. In quotation. The game knows. The game knows what I was doing. I feel like this is karma, like the game was like, oh, so, so you take off fake sick? Well, now you're real sick on your honeymoon, how about that? Damn it. <laughs> Whoa, oh shoot, what was that? Something about his birthday. Oh, oops. Probably should pay attention to that, whatever. Um, oh, great, so I guess I don't know how this happened. Did he just crap himself? What did he do? <laughs> his hygiene was not that, I do not remember his hygiene being that low before they left. What did he do? Okay, so let's uh, let's go over here and fertilize that. Just go take care of that. Oh wait, does is that is this food poisoning making him have to go to the bathroom a lot? Maybe that's. Oh yeah, it did say to stay near a bathroom, so I have a feeling that's making him go to the bathroom a lot. Thanks a lot. Just just thank you so much, Sims Four. Let's go back. My neighbor claims the teas at Human Hygiene Festival make you glow like. Oh dude, we even got the peeing sound effects to go with it. Uh no, sorry, we're not gonna go to that. Poor Caden. He's probably not really peeing, though, for being honest here. The Ryan's over here having a jolly old time with poor Caden's. Having a bathroom crisis over there in a bush. What did I even have him get for breakfast? Was it the... Oh, I think I got him the French toast. How do you get food poisoning for French toast? It, I don't know. Maybe they just didn't... What is he doing? Pu... Oh god, poor Caden! It's coming oh it's coming out of both ends. Oh <laughs> Yeah, I I don't know, maybe the eggs weren't cooked enough and it got salmonella or something like that. This is definitely putting a little bit of a damper on their their honeymoon here. Maybe we could have him get back into the water. Nope, nope, still uncomfortable. Um so unfortunately I can we have him dive at least? No, we can't do that. Aw. Well, I guess before they go out, I'll have to have them go back to the hotel and clean up a little bit. Yeah, definitely. Oh, there we go. He's feeling better now. Maybe we can get him back in the water. I mean, I don't think it's going to... It's not going to um, make his hygiene go up any, but... I don't know. I don't really want to leave her quite yet. Yeah, unfortunately, it doesn't make his hygiene go up. But then again, this probably isn't really the cleanest water. Let's splash him. Oh, ooh, it actually is helping his hygiene. Perfect. I didn't think it actually would. <laughs> oh, so that was great. Yeah, I, I, I think I, I think I'm gonna just um, play as these two in the next part because I really want to have another part doing this because I'm having fun. I'm having fun with this, and we're definitely because I think, yeah. So I guess um in the next part we can go to the ancient ruins and Von Haunt Estate and get some more pictures. Because I just want to have a bunch of pictures to hang up all over their apartment when they get back. Oh, see, look at that. His hygiene's go up. He's starting to feel a, little, feel a little better. Maybe if we stay in here for like 10 hours, he won't need to take a shower. Nah, I'm not quite patient enough for that. I really wanted to have them snuggle up by the bonfire, though. Uh, let's do that. What else should we have him do? Let's flirt with him. I'm glad he's at least feeling a little better, though. Let's see. Is the food poisoning mood like on? Okay, good. Yeah. yeah I think I'm still going to have to have debate best captains. Yeah, I feel like someone who someone who made this game likes brag about surviving food poisoning. Yes, I feel like someone who makes this game like Star Trek, because that's like the second Star Trek reference I've seen. Let's get to know. Sure, already know him pretty well. Discuss interests. Uh, you know what? Yeah, let's have him get out of the pool, get dressed, and then we can maybe have him snuggle by the bonfire a little bit. Alright, so let's get you back into your clothes. So go change into your little tourist outfit. And then uh, we'll get him into that. 
So I go, what? Why are you so shocked? Why are you, why are you so shocked by seeing that? Okay. Um, actually, should I? Or should I just have him go back to the hotel room? Mm, I think I'll just have him go back to the hotel room because... Hey, Wimbo. I was going to go to the ancient runes anyway, the next part. So I figure I can just have them snuggle up by bonfire once they're there. So I'll just finish up the next day by... Or finish up the next part or whatever by having them go to the ancient runes. Because, I don't know, I just wanted them to enjoy the nightlife here in Windenburg a little bit. Um, so I'm going to have them go back to the have them go back to the inn, wash up, and then get them out to the nightclub. Well, now that these two are cleaned up in a better mood, let's get them on in here to have some fun. Because Caden definitely needs to have a little fun. So, oh, looks like Olivia's here. I guess we can have him go in here and say hi to her, tell a joke. That'll help, probably help this fun some. What is Ryan doing? Okay, grabbing some chips. Oh yeah, he's a little hungry, so let him do that. Uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna have these two stick out here for a couple hours, just have some fun, dance, and wind a little bit. Um, but, yeah, let's get him to dance some. Can we have him show off some moves? Let's do that. I don't know if he really has much in- yeah, he's just got arm charm. Um, whatever. We'll- we'll have him show it off anyway. Hopefully that'll be fun for him. Okay, is he actually gonna do that? Okay, no, he's just talking to his mom. Okay, stop doing that so we can show off your moves. There we go. Alright, so we'll see how well he actually does with this. Oh, look at that, not doing too bad. That's fun. <laughs> yeah, hopefully this is helping his fun. Well, we can just have him and Ryan dance together for... A little bit. Uh, how is he doing other than that? Okay, starting to get a little hungry. We can just have him grab something from the bar soon then. But yeah, I just want to get his fun up a little because we do need to work on that. Because he he definitely did not have a fun day so far. Which is rather unfortunate because it was supposed to be their honeymoon. It was supposed to be a good day. But nope. He just had to get food poisoning with his breakfast. Alright, whatever. There we go. Now he's having some fun. Alright, so there's Ryan. There we go. Showing off some moves. Not bad. Are we able to have him and Ryan do a group dance? Yes. I don't know. I just wanted these two to do a group dance. I don't think they're very good at dancing. But, I don't know. I think it'd be kind of cute. Are we going to do that? Oh, there's Lily. Yeah, that's cool. Their parents are here. So we got Olivia and Bobby. And then... I wonder if Ryan's here. No, I don't think so. Alright, are we going to go do that group dance? All right, let's see how this goes. Oh, look at that! <laughs> oh, they're doing so well. I like to imagine this is maybe kind of like a coordinated dance they came up with for their wedding. Some people do that where they um like they have their bridesmaids and um groomsmen. Was that they what they're called? Best I forget. I forget what it's called on the guy's side, but um sometimes they have them all do a chore choreographed dance. Uh, what is he doing? Sleeping? No, 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 no. Let's not nap. Let's get back out here. You know, let's take a... Let's... Hold on. Let's, um... Let's get the camera back in Ryan's inventory and then have them take a group picture together. Yeah, so we can, um... There we go. Take a photo with. Yeah, we can just have them take a nice... Because I just want to have them take a photo together wherever they go. Although I didn't take a photo at the inn. So perhaps we should do that when they get back there. But yeah, I just want to have them take pictures wherever they go just to kind of remember this whole trip by... All right. Oh, nice. How how did he acquire the DJ mix He's not even doing any DJ. All right, then whatever. I guess Caden's now a DJ. And there we go. Taking the picture. Oh, so cute. Looks like they're having fun. All right. I think that looks good to me. Uh, let's make it a large photo. I guess I'll just turn off the. I'll turn the flashback on for these ones. Might be helpful since it's so dark. All right. There we go. Yeah, I think I'm gonna. I think I'm probably gonna have these two head out of here soonish then, because he's just trying to fall asleep. Caden looks like he's hanging in there pretty well though. Oh no, he's got about the same level of energy. Yeah, so I have a feeling he's probably gonna try taking a nap fairly soon. What is? What is she doing? Oh, vampire praise. Okay, that's cool. Ryan, get back up, please. Right, let's joke about old times. And ooh, ooh. we can have them get a little scandalous and woohoo in the closet. Maybe. So I have a deep conversation. 
Actually, instead of that, let's do a little bit of flirting. So, ooh, we can kiss him. There we go, yeah. Come on, go down there. What are you doing? Okay, there he is. Yeah, go down there and talk to your husband. I almost said boyfriend. No, husband now. Oh, I'm so excited they're married. Yeah, I really... I don't know, I would like them to start a family the next time I'm with them, just because... I want someone who's let's play to have more kids. Alright, just, just stop doing that and go up and kiss him. Come on. Aww. Okay, um... Uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna wrap this up soon. Um... Well, I guess we can just have them woohoo in the closet, and then... Yeah, after they they do that, I think I'm gonna just go ahead and wrap this part up. Okay, it looks like they're going to go do that. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna go wrap this part up here. Next time I'll just continue on with this little honeymoon because... Yeah, I haven't... One part just wasn't enough to be able to do everything that I wanted to do, and I'm having fun with this. But... Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and bye!